Go and welcome to our virtual Pilates class. So today we're going to start in a seated position. So crisscross. Take both hands and rest them on each knee, keeping your back nice and tall. Relaxing the shoulders, taking a deep breath in, exhaling through the mouth. Good, let's drop the head, chin to the chest. And then let's see curve. Feel as though someone's taking the center of your spine and then pulling it behind you, curving the shoulders over. Good, and then starting to roll back up through the spine, vertebrae by vertebrae, and then bring your focus back up towards the center. Good, holding it here, take a deep breath in. And then exhale, chin to the chest, keeping the back tall. And then C curving, center of the spine reaches towards the back. Curving those shoulders over. Good, and then rolling back up through the spine. And then taking your focus and looking forward. And again, take a deep breath in. Exhale, drop the head. And then C curve. Good, roll back up through the spine and focus is forward. Now we're gonna incorporate the arms, take a deep breath and reach up towards the sky. And then exhale, melt the elbows down, hands on the knees, chin to the chest, and then C curve. Forward, hollow. That's in. And then exhale. Curving shoulders forward. Going back. tilt the head up and over. Right center, tilt the head up and over towards the left. Back to the center and towards the left. Good. And let's add our breathing. Inhale as you tilt. Exhale to the center. Inhale to tilt. Exhale to center. Good, we're gonna twist the head towards the right and back to the center. Twist the head towards the left and back to the center. One more each way. Last one. Good, let's drop the head down and look straight forward and look up. And then look straight forward again and drop the head and center and look straight back up. Good, we're gonna drop the head. We're gonna head roll to the right all the way around. Nice and slowly, releasing any tension in the neck. And again, around. And we're gonna do one more. Good, and then let's head roll to the left, all the way around. Good, last one. Good, drop the head and look forward. Let's do some shoulder rolls back for one, two, three, four more, five, eight. Roll it forward, one, two, three, four more, five, six, seven, and eight. Arm circles back for one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's roll forward for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Nice, let's take that right arm up and over towards the left, keeping plenty of space between your shoulder and your ear, having a slight bend in the elbow and then come back to the center. Up and over, look down, and come back to the center. And again, inhale, exhale, come back, inhale, and exhale, come back. Good, we're gonna change it up a little bit. So as we side bend, we're gonna look up at that hand, and then come back to the center. Side bend, look up at the hand, and come back. And again, inhale, exhale, look up, and come back, inhale, exhale, look up, Good. Let's have our arms out to a T with the palms facing forward, stretching the fingers away from one another. Let's do a small twist, come back to the center. Small twist, come back to the center. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Two more. 
Last one. Good, relax the arms. Take the right hand forward, the left hand back. Give a small twist, pressing those shoulders down. Good, come back to the center, left hand forward, right hand back, small twist. And holding it, take a deep breath in. And exhale, come back to the center. Nice, I'm gonna face sideways just so you can see me. Sitting nice and tall, uh, right on top of your sit bone, reaching the hands forward about shoulder width apart, palms facing the ground, squeezing your fingers together. Elongate through the neck, top of the head is reaching up towards the sky. Keeping the legs together and the knees melting down towards the floor. Let's flex the feet and let's take a deep breath in. And then as we exhale, let's stretch the toes. And take a deep breath in, flex. And exhale, stretch. And keep going, inhale to flex. Exhale to stretch. And let's do two more. And last one. Good, keep the toes stretched. We're gonna drop the hands. First, we'll put the, place the palms up to face the sky. We're gonna drop them down by our sides and we're gonna reverse snow angel them up and around. Palms are now facing forward and then as they come down, flip the palms up to face the ceiling. Good, brush them against the ground and have them come back up. Good, and now we're gonna incorporate our feet. So flex the feet as the arms go up and then stretch the toes as the arms come down. Flex the feet, stretch the toes. Good, and have your movement go with your breath. Inhale as you flex and arms go up. Exhale as your feet stretch and arms come down. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Last one. Okay, keep the feet flexed and keep the arms reaching up towards the sky. Let's try to reach up and over towards the toes, keeping those knees down. Take the right hand, reach for the left ankle, and take the left hand and twist towards the left side. We're gonna hold it here for eight counts. Holding one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and switch. Reach for the right ankle, the left hand, and twist towards the right side, stretching the fingers away from another. Holding it here for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, a, keep the feet flexed and reach past those toes, keeping the knees down. Holding it here, let's take a deep breath in. And exhale, stretch those toes. Good, roll back up to the spine. Let's take that right foot and place it up and over the left. Taking the left hand, place it over the right knee. Press yourself away from the ground, keeping plenty of space between your shoulder and your ear. Hold it here, let's take a deep breath in. And hold it here as you exhale. Good, and come back to the center, untwist, let's do the other side, left over right. Take your right hand and place it up and over the left knee. Again, keeping plenty of space between your shoulder and your ear, along it through the neck. Holding it here for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and come back to the center. Nice, small V with the legs. Keeping them flexed, arms out to the side, let's have the palms face forward, stretching the fingers away from one another. Good, let's twist and we're gonna hold it and then come back to the center. And then we're gonna twist to the right and we're gonna hold it and then come back to the center. Twist and hold and center, twist and hold and center. Good, let's twist and we're gonna do itty bitty pulses for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, come to the center and twist and pulse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Good, let's come back to the center and twist again. We're gonna take that right hand and reach for the left foot. Keep both knees down and then we're gonna roll up through the spine, come back to the center. Twist to the right and reach for the right foot with the left hand and then roll back up and come to the center. Good, twist reach, roll up, and center. Twist, reach, roll up, and center. One more each way. Twist, reach, roll up, and center. Last one. Twist, reach, roll up, and center. Good. From here, keep the feet flexed and your legs in a small V. Both hands are reaching up towards the sky with the palms facing each other. We're going to take a deep breath in. And then as we twist and exhale, we're going to stretch those toes. And then inhale, flex. 
exhale, stretch. Inhale, flex. Exhale, stretch. Inhale, flex. And exhale, stretch. Good, and then relax, shake it out. Okay, all right, let's lie down on our backs. Feet are flat, knees are facing the sky. Legs are hip-width apart. Arms are down by your side, palms facing the mat. Let's squeeze our fingers together and holding it here. Press your shoulders down and elongate through your spine. Feel as though someone's stretching you from the top of your head and your tailbone and you're elongating each vertebrae as long as you can. Good, sink the tailbone down into the ground. Let your knees feel weightless. You can even sway them back and forth just to make sure there's no tension in the legs. Good, and hold it here. Let's take a deep breath in. And hold it here as you exhale. Good, let's hug that right knee in towards the chest with both hands, interlacing the fingers right on top. And let's flex that foot. And then stretch it. And then flex. And then stretch. Good, one more. Inhale to flex. Exhale to stretch. Good, let's do some ankle circles. Think as though there's a giant crayon on the, on the tip of your big toe. And you draw, want to draw a big circle all around the room. And for one, two, three, and four. Reverse, five, six, seven, and eight. Good job, other side. Flex that left foot, holding it here. Keeping the right foot planted with the knee up facing the sky. And then stretch that left toe. Good, and then flex, and then stretch. Good, and let's do some ankle circles on the left foot. Go around for a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Good, reverse the direction. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, good. Hug both knees in towards the chest. Keeping the tailbone down, relaxing the shoulders, elongating through the neck, sinking the head down in towards the mat. Holding it here, let's take a deep breath in. Good, and exhale. Good, let's place the hands behind the head, interlacing them back. Let's point the elbows up towards the sky. Both feet are flat and knees are facing up. Let's lift the right leg into table and then back down. Same thing with the left. Table and down. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Good. Let's stretch those legs out. Pointing the elbows up. Let's lift the hand shoulders off the mat. Chin away from the chest. Peeling the shoulders off as well. As you lift your upper body, you're pressing your lower body down into the mat. Good. And then roll back down. Good, keep those elbows pointing up towards the anime. And inhale, take a deep breath in. And then exhale, roll back down. Keep going for three. And exhale. Four. And exhale. Five. Six. Seven and eight. Nice. Lift the legs into a tabletop position, keeping the knees together and the toes facing out. Let's do eight tabletops. Hold it up here, peel the head and shoulders off, keeping the chin away from the chest, and then roll back down. And inhale, and exhale. And for three, four, five, six, seven, and last one, eight. Good. Take both legs and stretch them out to an angle, keeping the tailbone down and each vertebrae connected to the mat. Bring both legs into table and then stretch it out. And for two, and out. Inhale to table, exhale to extend. Four, and extend. Five, six, seven, last one. Good. Lift the head and shoulders off. Interlace the fingers, hold it. Hug in your right knee towards your chest and let your left leg cover the mat. And then switch legs, extend the right and hug in the left and switch again. And inhale to switch and exhale to switch. And for three, four, five, six, 
seven and eight. Keep going, flex your feet. Switch, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and hug both knees in towards the chest and relax. Good, feet flat, knees facing the sky, legs are hip width apart, arms are down by your side, lift one leg into table and then toe tap, and lift again to table and toe tap. Keep going for three, four, five, six, seven, and last one. Good, lift the left leg into table for one, and toe tap, two, three, four, five, six, seven, last one, eight. Good, take both hands, let's reach them up towards the sky. Keep them shoulder width apart with the palms facing each other, squeezing the fingers together. Keep reaching behind the head. Reach all the way back up towards the ceiling and then rest your arms back down by your side with the palms facing the mat. Good, reach up towards the ceiling. Reach behind the head. Keep the shoulders pressing down. Reach up towards the ceiling. Relax your arms back down by your side. Inhale to reach up towards the ceiling. Exhale to reach behind the head. Inhale back up and exhale. Good, let's use the arms and legs. We're just gonna use the right leg. Lift the right leg to table as the arms reach up and then extend the right leg up as your arms go back. Bring it back into table as the arms reach forward to the ceiling and then relax everything back down. Good, and then we do the same thing on the left. Arms up, leg and table. Extend arms back, back to table, reach the ceiling and then relax back down. And again, on the right, inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale, left foot, inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. Two more, inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. Last one, exhale, inhale, and relax. Good, hug your right knee in towards your chest and relax your left leg all the way down. Keep a hold of the right knee with the left hand, relax your right arm out to the side, palm facing the ceiling, and let's bring it up and over towards um, your left side. Let gravity pull that knee down and relax both hands out to a T position. And we're gonna hold it here for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come back to the center. Grab a hold of that right knee with the right hand. Let's melt it down towards the right side and then all the way down to meet the left. Good, hug it back in, relax it to the side, and relax all the way back down. And hug back in to the right, and all the way back down. Good, and left foot. Hug the left knee in towards the chest with both hands, interlaced above the left knee, and hold it here, take a deep breath in, and still holding as we exhale. Good, grab a hold of that left knee with the right hand, relax your left hand out to the side, and bring it up and over. Good, let gravity pull that knee down, both hands out to the side, holding it here. Good, take a deep breath in. Hold it here as you exhale. Good, and let's come back to the center. Hug that left knee in towards the chest with the left hand, and relax your knee out to the side and all the way down to meet the other leg. Good, and hug it back in towards the chest, relax it out to the side, and all the way down. Good, and let's do two more. Inhale up. Exhale to the side and all the way down. Good, last one. And all the way down. Nice. All right, let's flip over into a prone position on our stomachs. Let's go into our sphinx position. And our, we're gonna be resting on our forearms, keeping your legs shoulder width apart, spreading your fingers away from one another, reaching your chest forward, keeping your shoulders down away from your ears, top of the head reaches up towards the sky. Keep pressing your pelvic bone down into the ground, stretching energy through your feet right behind you. Holding it here, let's take a deep breath in. Good, and exhale. Good, and very slowly, let's roll down. Roll the chest down and hover the face over the ground. Good, and then top of the head reaches back. Rolling up through the spine, come back to your sphinx position. Keep your forearms connected for now. Good, and then roll that chest back down. Hover the head over the mat. Good, and then top of the head reaches back. 
Press down with your forearms, shoulders down away from your ears. Good, and then roll back down. Good, and then inhale to lift. Exhale to lower. Good, inhale to lift. And exhale to lower. Good, now we're gonna walk those hands slightly more in towards the shoulders. And as we press down, we're gonna to start to lift the forearms off. Don't completely stretch them. Always keep a slight bend in the elbows and then roll back down to hover the head over the mat. Good, and then inhale, press your palms down to the ground, slightly lift the forearms off. And then exhale, roll back down. Good, and let's do one more. And release. Good, walk the hands in and let's crawl back into a child's pose. Curl into a small ball, reaching those hands forward, breathe into your back and hold it here. Taking a deep breath in, hold it here as you exhale. Good, let's walk your hands up and over towards the right. Stretching out our left side. Good, and move through the center, up and over towards the left. and come back to the center. Let's come to our quadruped position. So hands and knees, arms underneath the shoulders, legs underneath the hips, spreading the fingers away from one another. Focus is down. Hold it here, let's take a deep breath in. And hold it here as you exhale. Good, let's go into our cat position. So tuck, so think as though if you were a scared dog and you're tucking your tail right between your legs and you're curling the tailbone right underneath. And you're gonna drop the head. We're creating the letter N with the spine. Hold it in here, let's take a deep breath in. And exhale, flatten the back, tailbone neutralizes and a focus is back down towards the ground. Good, and again, take a deep breath in, roll through the spine. And exhale, flat back. Good, and then top of the head reaches up, tailbone reaches up, show your imaginary necklace to the person in front of you. Good, press those shoulders back and down. Good, and take a deep breath in, move through the neutral center. And then keep going, come into your cat, and then exhale, come back to your neutral position. Good, and again, lift the head and tailbone, inhale, and exhale, cat position. Good, crawl back into child's pose. Walk your hands underneath you very slowly, let's roll up through the spine, head is the last thing, focus is down. All right, let's go on our side. Place your mat arm behind your head and the outside arm slightly in front of your chest. Squeezing the legs together with one leg on top of the other, we're gonna bend our knees so as if we were standing would be in the kneeling position. Top leg is gonna open while keeping the feet connected and keep reaching that top hip forward. To self-check, take your top hand and keep a hold of your hip and make sure that it doesn't stop wobbling all over the place, keep pushing it forward and then squeeze those legs together. Knee reaches up, we'll keep the net hip forward, and then squeeze it back down. For three, and down. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Good, stretch legs. We're gonna lift it up, connect the toe to the knee, and extend. Toe to knee, and extend. Three, keep reaching that hip forward, four, Five, six, seven, last one is eight. Nice. All right, let's do the other side. Mat on behind the head. Other arm slightly in front of the chest. One knee is on top of the other. Bend the knee so as if you were standing, you'd be kneeling. Good, keep both feet together as that knee reaches up towards the ceiling. And to self-check, keep the left hand on the left hip and keep pushing it forward. Good, open and close for two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Good, both stretch both legs out. Top leg reaches up and connect the toe to the knee and extend. Toe to knee and extend. Three, four, five, six, seven, Last one, nice. Good, come back to a seated position. Crisscross. 
Take that right hand, reach it right across your chest. Have your shoulder reach in the opposite direction of your fingers. Holding it here and let's take a deep breath in. Good, still holding as you exhale. Good, place it by behind the head and apply a small amount of pressure onto the elbow. Keeping the back nice and tall, pressing the shoulders down. Good, and left, right across the chest. Good, and drop. Small amount of pressure onto the elbow, holding it here, pistol shoulders down. Good, and let's interlace those fingers and stretch up with the palms facing the sky and reach forward into a flat back. Good, open up the hands to the sides and all the way back, interlace your fingers and stretch them back. Good, and then come back up and we're gonna do it again, right and right across the chest, hold it here, take a deep breath in. Hold it here as you exhale. Good, other side. Deep breath in. Hold it here as you exhale. And other hand up and over. Apply a small amount of pressure to the elbow. Good, and other side. Good, and to lay, stretch it up, palms looking up towards the ceiling, and then reach it forward. Arms out to the side, all the way to the back, interlace and stretch. Good, and then come back up, hands on the knees, take a deep breath in. And hold it here as you exhale. Tilt your head up and over towards the right and take your right hand and just assist it slightly, small, applying a small amount of pressure on the left side of the head. Good, and look down. Good, and switch up and over. Good, and look down. Good job, and give yourself a clap. Nice work, and I hope you liked your virtual Pilates, and I will see you all soon.